to today's task, courtesy of Power Oil. I cook extremely well. My baby is here, Angel. It's my food every single day. Yeah, so it's not about going to the kitchen to cook, but it's about cooking it well. And... I don't want it to burn. Table is dirty. There's rice all over the place. And. Green team. Congratulations. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel and I'm Lillian. So power oil task o'clock. This particular task came with three phases. But the first phase is the debate. And the house was divided into two teams. We have the guys uh, and the ladies. And they are to debate on women are naturally better cook than men. So the ladies are supporting the emotion while the men are to oppose this line big brother informed them that for each round each team must present two speakers and at the end of the debate that they will be judged on their coherence and strength of arguments the ladies flagged off based on the fact that women are naturally groomed to be cooks that right from um, early stage your mom is already preparing you for the fact that the, you know in africa they have this mindset you must be a good cook to satisfy your husband if you don't cook well this 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 that that and that this makes women um natural cooks the men came through as well with their points so much saying that in their house um their mom cook, their mom teach both the male and female gender so that 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 makes them all uh natural cooks and for the fact that you've been groomed so that it doesn't count as being natural cook but if the ladies want to say oh they were nurtured from early stage that that makes them natural cook then him as well that he's a natural cook and besides he has been feeding his baby girl angel <laughs> that even angel can testify to his meals that angel overeats just because of how delicious his meals can be they even pointed out to adekule cooking for venita in fact eh, the men came through the ladies came through as well like at the time i was like give them it turned into something else when the man mentioned how it was white money who is a guy that will be cooking for them for weeks that i live by you haven't even cooked in the house messy i've just cooked so i you know they were trying to mention times a uh, few times the ladies have cooked how are they clay cooks for venita and venita say you know are they makes um soggy meals or what 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 you know they were just coming for each other but that white money zone i said mm, that's a point right <laughs> <laughs> that's a point right there because of those my body go cook 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 at thought <laughs> both the ladies and the men really give a very great point now to the second phase of the task the second part of the task is called walk your talk cooking challenge so for this part the housemates were divided into it into a group that's two teams but this happened after a lucky dip and cc picked um game master so she's the one in charge of this particular game in this one the housemates at um, each team is expected to cook a meal but then in each team there will be various rules that everybody will play in the sense that they have the chef they have hygiene master they have a table setter and a store runner and everybody is to keep to their duty although when it comes to cooking it will be a collective effort because people have said that the goal is to prove that great cooking come from great teamwork okay so in as much as you perform that um duty you are expected of you can as well help but when they say chef it's just one chef when they say a uh, storekeeper is that particular person that um, is a store, store runner sorry when they say store runner is that particular person who have picked the role of a store runner that will do whatever activity the store runner is expected to carry out you're loading your head but you can remember that my stew you cannot even stop talking about it a good home teaches both the male child and the female child after every each team member has picked a role we have cross and angel as store runner for their various teams and they were made to you know run around the garden 
picking ingredients they will need for what they will cook <laughs> you have to run as fast as you can you know pick, they were given two minutes to search around everywhere except we had to have um the gas cooker you have to move every other part of the uh of the arena searching for ingredient now <laughs> funny thing a funny thing happened cross picked um all the chicken and later on discovered that their meal requires that they will even need beef <laughs> for it and when they were not asking the other guys if they can you know share and all that Vrinda was not like oh you went and pick ingredient that you won't need blah 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 you know Vrinda now <laughs> so for the red team we have cross as the store runner remember the duty of the store runner is to search for ingredients and we have mercy as the chef chef she'll be the one doing the cooking while we have ile baye as the hygiene master so now she'll be working uh, hand in hand with Mercy. In the sense that if Mercy is cooking, she'll be cleaning, assisting, asking her, do you need this? Do you need that? And make sure everywhere is being tidied up immediately. And then we have Soma as their table setter. So the role of this table setter now is after the meal has been done, this is the person that will set the table and create the presentation. For the green team, they have Angel as their store runner, Adekule as their chef, Pere as their hygiene master, and Venita as their table setter. And each team has 30 minutes to, to do their cooking with Sisi going around to Spivers as the game master. But then along the line, Adekule's team started asking Big Brother to please extend the time, being that their boner was giving them issues. The third phase of this task is called the go light. Each team is expected to go a four round, and for each round they will have one player. So at a playing um, at a go, we have two players. That's two opposing players, and what is expected of them is to roll a six. You have to roll a dice. But this time, you know, on their normal game, if you roll a six, you start playing. But this time, what you do is you get a six and then roll again to get the number you are to proceed with. And for every time you get to a tail ladder, you are expected to climb the ladder towards the direction it's pointing. If it's pointing to 20, if it's pointing to 25, you go straight up. For every time it's a head of a stake, you have to hold to the tail of the snake. That means you're going down. Then, for any time you step on a red step, the game master is to ask you, is to um, pick a card. They actually have a card there, and you perform a quick fitness task. It can be to skip, it can be jumping jack, depending on what the card states. And for every time you step on the green step, you are to answer um, a health question or a question regarding power oil for any uh, fitness task you fail to perform you have to take a, take a step back so if you are on a 19 and you fail that question you go to 18 and as well any question um any healthy question you have been asked and you fail to get the correct answer the same thing you take a step back as well very interesting game at the end of this round the green team came top and Big Brother asked them to go into the house while their food gets tested. Immediately, Big Brother announced this. You needed to see how the housemates rushed for their food. But then, what I don't understand is why Green Team even went for Red Team's food. Like, wouldn't you just pretend and <laughs> rush your own meal so that after the score, you can now, you know, go show interest in the other meal? Because if I'm to be a judge and I'm seeing a competitor go scoop food from another, I would just assume that, ah, you actually find that f that food more tantalizing than your team do you get but anyway they should just like me i said they should have fun while playing the game but being that it's a competition well i'm not in the house returning back to the arena and big brother said to score their cooking skill it was based on teamwork plating and taste now for the taste the red team won that session but then for plating and Teamwork, the green team won. Big Brother had CC to go around and check their workstation. And the red team, you know, their workstation was messy. Being that, like I said, the green, some of the house, um, the part of the green team, you know, were rushing to taste their meal. So, and after that, they didn't tidy up. I doubt they tidied up. 
the plates, the rice, everything was there. So in general, the green team won this task. And Big Brother also told them that the ladies won that of the debate. For, for, so for the green team, we have Angel, Adekule, Venita, and Pere. Congratulations to them all. Thank you for watching. Bye. Five, six. Green question. What? Down. Down. Down.